what's up everybody welcome to another video today i'm going to show you how to use the playstation 4 controller on the playstation 3 and yeah this is possible it's not that complicated there are two ways you can do that there are two ways you can use a playstation 4 controller on the playstation 3 the first would be a usb cable just connect it to the playstation 4 controller the dualshock 4 there and that's it now observe However, what if we want to use that controller wirelessly on the PlayStation 3? Is it possible? The answer is yes. But it can work. So the first thing you do is to bring in the USB cable. Connect it to the PlayStation 4 controller. Now we go to the accessory settings, select manage bluetooth devices and select register new device. As you can see I already registered the controller, however I'm going to delete it to show it to you from the beginning. So anyway, as you can see there is no bluetooth device registered, you select yes and start scanning. Now while it's scanning, you remove the controller from the USB hook port. There. And now we press start and share button. Now keep pressing start and share button at the same time. As you can see it says wireless controller after resting for a while. Now you'll have to use the other controller if you have one and press X. Now we just wait a little bit and there it's done. Observe. See no wire and it works fine. Now I should let you know a few things here and there of course, the controller is great, the PlayStation 4 controller is the best DualShock in my opinion, it's not perfect but I like it. Anyway, if you're going to use it on the PlayStation 3, there are a few things I should let you know about. There are a few things I should let you know about that might bother you. The first thing of course is the touchpad. It's really useless here touchpad is very useless on the PlayStation 3 now the second thing is the share and option button you probably know that the option button replaces start in the original controller however for the share button it replaces select here one thing you should know is that uh, the PlayStation 4 controller work has uh, motion features but they only work on the PlayStation 4 meaning with the PlayStation 3 it won't work observe this is a little big planet if you move the controller uh, if you move the controller Sackboy will move his head nothing works now let's try on the PlayStation 3 version see fortunately this isn't really a feature Fortunately, this isn't really something that could bother me much as most games don't really use the motion features in, in them as most games don't use the motion features in them with a few exceptions I guess like Little Big Planet, Uncharted and The Last of Us Speaking of which, I'm going to show you something about The Last of Us right now 
Anything like this, that's all. The Last of Us is a great game. Yeah. Now, but I really tried to play it with the DualShock 4 controller and PlayStation 3 version, and I did notice something. It's rarely noticeable. Now it's rarely noticeable, but sometimes the controller doesn't work well. Like for, for example, right here, I'm trying to run. And it's not uh, stamina, there's not really any stamina in the game, not that I know of. But at rare moments, he just slows down. Joel just slows down on his own. I never really experienced this issue only uh, here right now in The Last of Us. So I should let you know. And now for the final problem, this really could shock you a little bit. Let's say you want to change the game but only digital or if you just want to quit it. Look, you know how to uh, get out of the game but let me show you how. Here's the PlayStation button. Here, if you can see, nothing happened. No, the controller works fine. But now let's try this. The PlayStation 3 controller. See? There's no problem. You see the problem here is that this button, the PlayStation button doesn't work at all in the PlayStation 3. In the DualShock 4, in the PlayStation 4 controller I mean. So that means you need a second PlayStation 3 controller, whether it's a move controller, guitar, normal controller doesn't matter as long as it has the playstation button and the playstation 3 controller and the playstation 3 controllers then you can get out uh, of the game and go to the main menu otherwise you can't use it that's all there is to say about the DualShock 4 controller one thing i almost forgot maybe you have a playstation 4 and the playstation 3 but you just use the DualShock controller of the playstation 4 to switch between them so let's say you just turn on your PlayStation 4 instead of the 3. Look, it says here press the PlayStation button on the PlayStation 4 controller. It doesn't work. That's because if you use the DualShock 4 and the PlayStation 3, it kind of makes it think it's a PlayStation 3 controller. So what do you do about it? Very simple. Then you bring the charging wire to the PlayStation 4 controller. There, it's connected. And it's over. You just simply work for it. And it works fine. But don't worry. You can... You can pretty much just connect the wire and continue back again. It will work normally. Thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I really hope you found it useful and if you do please like and subscribe and I will see you guys next time.